hello YouTube and welcome to a very special episode where instead of Max actually playing a stupid Kerbal, I'm gonna do it, okay? <laughs> and for once, I actually built a design that actually works. Okay, he has not done the skip tutorial and don't do the tutorial ever again. Wow. This is actually, I should also mention, I'm actually not doing this on my computer. This is why you can actually see, actually see everything. It's because this isn't actually my computer. This is Max's. He just let me borrow it for a day. And basically, I'm going to show you how everything works. Now, with the Mac, I'm not sure if it has different controls for everything. Um, it's on a Mac. Um, I don't know, but we will see. Let's see. Does F still work? F still works. Does shifting still get throttles? Control still does everything right. Okay, we are all ready to go. This is the Max 13. This is not the Max 12. The Max 13 on my personal thing has personally made it to the moon. And, you know, it's been pretty well. And I'm going to do this, guys, much better than Max did. Because I actually know what I'm doing. So you press F, you press that, you go to resume flight, launch. Da 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 da. Wow, this is a way smoother computer than mine. I like this! Wow! I don't know guys, don't buy anything off a store, just make your own, own ship. This is much more convenient. Oh my goodness, why do I? Wow. Okay guys, we're about to get through the first stage right now. And we are going to lose surface area, but we will slowly go back up in a couple seconds. So, now it's just a relaxing period of relaxfulness and... I am looking around everywhere. This is kind of weird because I'm not... He let me borrow his computer, but I'm actually at Max's house right now. So this is just kind of interesting to look at all his knickknacks and stuff. Like, he doesn't have, like, a messy, messy area of any sorts. It's just, like, cluttered with all this random junk that I don't know what the heck it is. Like, he has a... He has a, um... Random House Spanish English to English Spanish Dictionary, more than 60,000 entries and 100,000 definitions. Hundreds of new words, including international IPA pron pronunciations, revised and updated. Stuff like that. I have no clue. Oh, he's taking Spanish, so I guess that's the reason why, but. Eh. Como estas? We got, we got the basic thing going, and we're about to 7,000 feet, yes! And the actual goal to this is to actually reach the moon. If we don't reach the moon, that's okay with me. It's kind of, it'll kind of be okay. I mean, it, it's kind of nice to just be kind of by myself in this kind of recording. I know, Max is usually joining me with his own little, well, blunders of himself trying to pilot my ships, but... The only, I guess the only real thing is, the person that can actually pilot ships is the person that actually knows how to pilot the ships. I mean, Max does a good job overall. Not, well, yeah, he does a good job overall. <laughs> um, but I think the best person to pilot this ship is the person that knows how to actually do it. So, that was partly why we also came in. There was another reason, is because, since I'm not the best on the um, survival speed challenge things... Um, I kind of wanted to do, wanted to do this to see if I could actually, you know, commentate by myself and not fail, because this has made to the moon once, the moon, it's right over there in, in the dark, wait, can I see it from here? I wonder if, wait, I, I'm not sure, uh, I'll have to look in the max about that, <sighs> okay, anyways, I'm, I'm having a good time, and we also started this new series called... Survive, um, typ a typical Minecraft series. And it's basically just us goofing around, making cool objects in this world. Um, recently we got two. Oh, shoot! Oh! Okay! That could have decreased things and made things very much harder for me if I did not pay attention. But I did, and now we got back going, and in a little bit I should start turning so I can get into orbit around the moon. Um, not yet, not yet, wait until we, wait until we get out of this yellow, uh, bluish area, right about now. Let's start curving, start turning, start turning. Now, when, now, this is the part where Max would be freaking out, and telling me, what the heck, what the heck am I supposed to do, and I'd be like, just do this! 
Well, I actually know what I'm doing, so this is this is quite easy for me. Okay, so we got we got 90 percent. We are going to start. As you can see, we're going to start the curving, the cool gigantic curve. Ain't it pretty? It's just the prettiest thing in the world. But anyways, I might as well get back to my subject I was talking about before this. I was talking about you know how how Max and I have started that new YouTube, that typical Minecraft series and. I don't know, we might do a typical Minecraft series where we go to the nether, we beat everything, we build awesome structures. Hey, that is what we're doing. The fit name fits well, everyone. But, no. But we're going to try and make it interesting. Um, we did kind of implement a rule saying that we can't die. But, um, there have been many evidence to suggest that we should probably eliminate that rule. Or at least make it... At least make it a little bit more fair, because... Max and me are going to make mistakes at some point, and that's just going to aggravate everyone, so... You know, we're, we're thinking about that right now. Um, I'm not going to reveal anything specifically about what happens or what is happening. I mean, he hasn't even uploaded the first episode, so I can't really give you guys much about it. But I hope you guys are paying attention to it, and please support us in anything we do. A comment here, a dislike there, a... A I hate your YouTube channel and you should go to hell there. You know, it really does help us when you guys support us with nice, kind, and gentle words. <laughs> oh my goodness. Please don't do that, people. It, it aggravates us more than you know. Especially considering that there is always one person, one person, who dislikes every single one of our videos. Since we begin, since we have began our YouTube channel, there has been only one person to, I'm going to give you a quick update. We are traveling around the moon. I mean, not the moon, the earth. And you, you, the, I'm going to jump from subject to subject, people. I'm scatterbrained person. Yeah! But anyways, there's been one person that dislikes our videos, and it gets aggravating. Because it's like, we don't know who this person is, and if we knew who it was, hmm, Maxwell would probably hack into his computer. That's what I'm guessing what would happen. Okay? That is exactly what I think what would happen. Is that we would hack into his computer, probably convert all his files to never make sure he'd memo memorize his YouTube account, and then... Oh, here comes next stage, everyone. We're going to the next stage. Da, 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 da. Okay. Now, from past experience, you should stop boosting now and start boosting near the Apple Oasis. Apple Oasis? Yeah, Apple Oasis. That's how you say it. Apple Oasis. Apple Oasis, there's a... Uh, wait. Okay, we're expanding the Apple Oasis. Okay, now, yeah, I'm in the perfect position because, wait, I should probably establish a good, a good, um, not, not Apple Oasis, but a good Pente. Man, I, I, my terminology for this game is quite bad. Periapsis. Uh, um, one second, I have to figure this out. Periapsis, Apple Oasis. Periapsis. Okay, people, we got it from Max, who's sitting right next to me. Periapsis. Periapsis is what you call it. Periapsis and the Apple Oasis. Apple Oasis. Okay. I am going to start flying. Oh no no no. Okay, so we want to boost right about here to get the to get the periapsis. Why did they? Not to be rude, but why did they make such hard terms for for a person that is going to school? I'm not saying great, but why did they make this so hard for people? They're actual terms. Uh, I mean, who the heck did this? Is this in Latin or is this in English? Hmm. English is based I, on I'm Latin. Guessing, I'm guessing it's Latin, though. Oh, that really does sound stupid. But yes! Yes, my periapsis is expanding. Periapsis, yay. Okay, now we need to stop expanding. Because now what we need to do is that we need to get around... Actually, let's enjoy the view for a little bit. So let's see. Let's see what can we enjoy. Let us enjoy the view of Earth as we slowly circle around it. La 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 Oh, I think that's Russia. Wait, Cabal doesn't have the same Earth as we do. Anyways, that's Russia. That will be now known as Russia Land. Okay. Now that we've traveled a couple distances, we aren't quite to the point we need to be. We need to be right about here. We are approaching on it fast. And we just passed the periapsis. Woo! And let me... just, just This is just a quick query. Where's 
I'm wondering when all of Max's ships are. Oh, there's one. <laughs> what did he do? <laughs> what the heck did he do? I probably should have been watching that, but I wasn't. Okay. Sorry, people. I get sidetracked really easily. Let's do this. Let's boost towards the moon. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. It is time, people. Let us see if we can reach the moon. This isn't actually the trip to get to... Oh, wait, 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 wait. My pay apps is changing. Pay apps is changing. We are changing rapidly. Oh, great. We're not going fast enough. Faster! Faster! Okay. Okay. Oh! Get back in! Boost, boost down, boost down quickly! Damn, didn't boost, didn't boost down right. Okay, so let's go back in, tap it to right there, then go right down. Are we now over it? Um, not quite. We need to be at least a little bit over it, that way we can... That way we have two chances to get to the moon. Like that! Wait, is that... Nope, 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 that did not be good. Nice, nice, nice. Nope, because apparently we don't have controls. Okay, so let's just lightly tap that. And, okay, we're at 11,000. I didn't realize our orbit was so ob long, but let's just keep trying now. Now it's just time to watch us. I'm going to zoom in a little bit. I don't think we're going to reach the moon this, ra this round, but we should reach it in a couple days. So I might extend the, peri the periapsis to accommodate for that because fast traveling. Oh, no. No, no, no. Yep. Okay. Not this round, everyone. Next round, maybe. Okay, we speed up. It's time to do the oblong. And, oh, a little bit of history into spaceflight. The actual astronauts in the... in 1969 actually reached the moon. Took about three days... No, not three days, seven hours, six... six minutes, somewhere around there? I'm, I'm trying to remember. I remember. I remember it was very quick, but but it was quite amazing, and it was the first American feat that kind of what the heck? Okay, we apparently got back to Earth, and it was a very a very great feat for America to actually reach. But it's kind of the, the space program's kind of decreased in popularity over the years, considering that. Well, the fact that we can't figure out what to do with it anymore. Okay, maybe. Nope. Nope. It's right there. Okay, I'm definitely going to extend the periapsis once I reach the Apoasis again. But the the kind of NASA... NASA has kind of gone down in popularity because you really can't do anything with it anymore. I mean, we reached the moon. What else do we really need to reach? Besides, like... Besides, like, stupid orbiting... Um... I'm pretty sure if you boost towards this, it kind of creates a more, uh, let's see. It should either create more oblong, let's see, it's at 360, so let's see if that goes down. 360, it's creating more of a straightish orbit. Um, that's not what I want. Uh, okay, let's just, okay, let's disengage SAS, disengage SAS, and let's go towards this place. Maybe this will help boost. Okay, gauge SAS. Man, this is like really sensitive. Okay, let's go back to the middle. Engage SAS. Boost a little bit. Did that increase the periapsis? Yep, that increased it. So we have to boost towards that. I want to get around 500,000 just so that we can keep, you know, boosting around and around and around without there being much complications. Okay, are we at 610? Got it! Good! Okay, let's do this. Let's see if we can just keep going around and around. Okay, that's pretty good. That isn't too bad. We can live with this. Okay, but, yeah. The action, the, what I was trying to get at, people. Oh, 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 this looks like it's going to make it. It's either going to make it in the middle. Oh, yeah, we're going to make it. This is definitely going to make it. Oh, wait. Oh, come on! No! No! Why move? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot! That didn't... Wow. Okay, we are in the moon's orbit. It's now time to... Uh, get the stupid SAS off. Okay, now I have to find where the... 
non-circle part is and start boost the circle with an X is okay get get that and okay um back to my back to my earlier point is it's kind of decreased because well what else can we do we reach the moon um the science fiction isn't true we won't find advanced aliens out there so you know there's kind of this lull drive to kind of go to the moon again and you know I, I don't entirely agree with that I think that we should probably reach um some particular oh shoot we got into the orbit of the moon I am not paying attention to this at all <laughs> I, I'm gonna finish my thought people don't usually agree with this but I really do think that if we go back to the moon it, it will it will be a very special thing but I think we should probably go to Mars Mars because we've already been to the moon and uh, people say we should establish a Mars base but honestly people I don't think I don't honestly think we need to it's not required we've already been to the moon we've already know that we can get there why do we need a Mars base when it's not really gonna help us in the long-term effects I can see how it could like help us refuel and everything, but basically, you'd basically, you'd basically be setting kind of things back by like twenty years if we did not like just attempt to just go. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Okay, people, this might be a crash landing. Probably not though, because I'm not that bad. Let us see. I have to find exactly where the stupid X with circle is, and we are coming in for a landing. Uh, we are, just a little update, we are 16 minutes in, um, hopefully I can do this, um, first of all, we need to kind of, I'm not, wait, I'm not even gonna deal with this until, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, let's increase this, I'm not even gonna deal with this until we reach about 8 75,000 because there's no point in boosting anytime soon because it's not gonna help me. Okay, so we are boosting, we are we are decreasing orbit. Come on! Okay, so we're going to try to set ourselves up. So let's stop boosting. This is going to have to boost for a little bit. So this is, I think this is just going to be the journey of how I got to the moon. I'm at, I will probably going to include a different episode for how, if I can make it back. <laughs> That's always an interesting experience. Making, I'm, I'm trying to make this X thing go towards the circle. Come on, go towards the circle. Go towards the circle. I want to reach the circle. Maybe if I start boosting like right here. I have two. I have two like a one and a half oil spill, so I think it would. No, no, that that decreases it. Don't. Don't do that. Okay, so let's do this. Let's just keep boosting. We are approaching the moon, people. This is a feat Maxwell has never attempted or neither would want to. After his experiences with Kerbal and <laughs> so many crashes, this is what's going to happen. Okay, I'm going to stop boosting for a little bit and let it speed up a little bit because we don't really have to pay attention. Um, I know I can get it back down pretty easily once once we reach a good... I'm going to go for 30,000 feet, 30,000 is one. okay, yes, I'm also waiting for this to get to the center, just so that we have a good understanding, um, and I also should mention this, the moon isn't exactly at zero, zero, which is something I didn't realize when I first played this, so when I was like at 2,000, I thought I started at 2,000 feet, well, so I started speeding up, and I was like, good, Okay, let's do, let's detach the legs, which is G. Let us boost a little bit to the right. That way, it starts. I think if you boost towards stuff, okay, we're gonna start boosting. But ah, I really gotta stop getting sidetracked. But you basically, uh, basically, the, f the first time that you do this, it's not that. What am I talking about anymore? Oh my goodness, I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. That's. That's embarrassing on a YouTube commentary. Sorry, people. I forgot what I was talking about. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Now, here comes the difficult part. Here comes where the X has to kind of stay in the middle. We have to kind of keep the X in this kind of middle. I don't remember how I did it last time, but I'm going to decrease it now because we're at 50,000. We need to at least get below 5,000 before I start dealing with any more problems. Um... 
This is six, and oh shoot, this is this does not look like it is it is what it, it seems. So I'm gonna start boosting now. I'm gonna start decreasing. Get exactly in the center. Get exactly in the center. Um, this is actually very very hard, people. Don't don't judge me or judge Max if he fails millions and millions of millions of times. Just judge us on the fact that we actually did this. We actually got the courage to do this. So, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Okay, I'm at that point. I'm at the point now where if I, oh shoot, oh shoot, never mind, never mind. Keep going down, keep going down. Go back, go back, go back, circle. Good job, circle. We need that circle out. So, we need to kind of gently float down for a little bit. We're going to gently float down. La, 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 la. Man, I wonder how Max is going to do the music in this. <laughs> With my singing... It's going to be atrocious. Okay, we are doing good. We are doing good. The surface looks quite inviting, in fact. Let's go boost about. Let's boost a little bit harder. Boost a little bit harder. We don't want We really want to decrease all of our... You see, I still got half a fuel, people, so I could still make it back if I wanted to to Earth. Okay, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. We have to kind of slow it down a little bit. So we have to go to right about here. We don't want to... Decrease this. Okay, let's slow down a little bit more. I have to at least be at zip at 2.0 to make this work. So this is like really te tedious work. I mean, look at this. I'm. Oh my goodness, you guys can see the ground. Oh, okay. Let's just keep going down. Keep going down. Okay. Okay. Keep going up. Kind of just thing. And it's going too quick. Okay. So doing good. Oh, 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 oh! Oh! What the heck? What? Um! Stop! Stop! <gasps> People, we have officially landed on the moon. This is a noble feat for Kerbalians. One small step, one small step for Kerbal, another leap for Kerbal kind. And I can't see the the earth, so, um, just, wow, we made it. It seems like we had some malfunctions with the legs, but we made it. Ha! Ha! <laughs> Look! Kenny, Eliza, and Corbett, Corbett, has all made it. We are proud today, people. Thank you. And we will see you next time.